10 Elvis House moving inventory on the 19th of August 2022. So I'm just outside. You can see the door is clean with no scuff marks and no damage. Let's head on in. Just got to get the right key first. So that's the top lock. Perfect. So head straight on in. There is no strong odour or concerns. There is no chain. The door locks from the bottom. The door is clean with no concerns, no damage. Okay. Ceiling is white, clean, with no cobwebs, no stains, no leak marks. Light bulbs are working and present. So just a different angle of the ceiling. It's clean with no stains, no cobwebs, no concerns. The walls, as soon as you enter, you have scuff marks on the wall here and a few handprints. But in general, good condition with no cosmetic concerns. And then just eye level, you do have a few light marks which are present. And then towards the bottom above the skirting boards, slightly discolored. Door to storage is clean with no issues and above is clean. So the few items here that will be removed from the current tenant, but inside the walls are marked with paint chipped. No cobwebs. Light bulb working and present. And now you can see the, the marks on the walls. Flooring has all been hoovered. The door is clean with no scuff marks and no damage. Just going to go up and down the walls. So towards the bottom above the skirting board, mark present. And then marks above the switch. Marks above the radiator. Just general wear and tear marks. No cause for concern. And then just in line with the intercom phone, mark present on the wall. Intercom phone attached securely and then above it's clean. Photo attached securely to the wall and then just further on down towards the bottom, scuff mark in blue. Skirting boards are clean and dust free. Towards the bottom, paint has chipped and scuff marks are present. Further on up, it's clean with no cause for concern. Cobweb present, the door to water tank, clean with no issues. There is a gap between the door handle and the door. Inside, the door is clean with no concerns and items present. Water meter, generally in good condition. Wall between boiler and living room. Wall is white, well, magnolia, clean condition with no concerns. Above the door, it's clean. The door is clean with no black scuff marks, currently open. And the wall between the living room and second bedroom, clean with no concerns. Above, and then the door, clean condition with no damage. However, if you are looking at the door, you can see like the plastic cover kind of is chipped. It's all the way down, it's frayed. So I don't know if this is an additional cover put on the door, but you can see it's coming off. Wall between bedroom and bedroom, good condition, however, marks are present. Slight switch is clean, and then cobweb, and there's a cobweb above the door hand frame, above the master bedroom. Door is clean with no concerns. And then underneath the mirror it is clean with no issues, and the mirror itself is attached securely to the wall with no handprints, no dust. Left of the mirror, it's clean with no cause for concern. Above, no concerns. And then to the right, good condition. However, handprints towards the bottom of the light switch. And then the door to the bathroom. Clean condition with no damage. Lights the extract fan switch on. And then behind the door, generally in good condition. However, marks are present. So you can see the line here. So it's just discolored. There's no cause for concern. 
The skirting boards are clean, dust free. Laminate flooring, clean with no hairs, no dust, no stains. Hoovered and mopped. Obviously, I'm walking on the floor. There's no stickiness. Clean condition. There's no damage or cause for any concern. Just going to stop here. Just getting you a different angle, showing you it's all clean with no hairs, no dust, no dirt. Okay, I'm just going to pop my jacket off. Okay, so back into the hallway. We're going to head into the bathroom. So the door is clean, with no concerns, no water damage, good condition. Ceiling. So the ceiling is white, light bulb, two spotlights present. It's white, however, when you're looking at the light, you do have a couple of marks on the ceiling. Now, it looks like there's two, no, it's speckles of mould. There's speckles of mould present on the, the ceiling. Some here, some here, and then again some here. So three areas, mould, or oh, just a bit further down as well. So there's four areas of speckles of mould, but there's no other cobwebs or concerns. Um, the flooring is tiled, black, with no hairs, no dirt. This has been left. And a mat. But you can see there's no hairs or dirt. And the rug mat slash has all been hoovered. Just gonna put these on top. Toilet, tissue present, but it's clean with no hairs. Toilet is clean, flush is fine. No hairs, no dirt. Hand basin, it's clean. No lime scale, left side, right side, and the sealant is white. You have your mirror, which is clean with no concerns. And then you have your bathtub, which is clean with no concerns. Okay, you do have a couple of speckles of mold, which is hidden under the old sealant. And the shower curtain is white, it looks new. Okay, the magnolia walls are clean free from any paint peeling, any watermarks, any dirt, and any concern. It's slightly patchy towards the top, but in general, in good condition with no issues. So just going up and down, showing there's no mold, there's no paint peeling, and there's no cause for any concern. And the tiles are white marble with white sealant, white grout, excellent condition. You can see they're all clean, they've all been wiped down, there's no cracks, there's no damages, there's no hairs, there's no dirt. Lovely condition. So you do have a couple of cleaning products, which I'm just going to move out of the way. And then you have your shower hose and taps, which you can see are sparkling and clean. Inside the bathtub, it's clean and ready to use, lovely. Into the master bedroom. So behind is clean with no concerns, no marks, no damage, no dust, no dirt. Ceiling is white, clean, with no stains, no cobwebs, and no cause for any concern. Light bulb working and present. Just gonna get a different angle. Oh, that door was left open. Hey. Oh, okay, the door's just gonna be left open. Ceiling's clean. No cobwebs. Light bulb working and present. You have a three door fitted wardrobe, stable, empty condition. And then you have a freestanding chest of drawers. Three. 
for five, all empty and clean. Mattress with no stains. Oh, mattress with stain. Oh, I don't know what this is. Ah, do you know what it is? I think what they've done, they've put baking soda on it to pick up any odours and any scent. So this just needs hoovering, but you do have black marks present. I will speak to the landlord for him to do. Oh yes, okay. Behind the bed, you can see it's discoloured on the wall. Probably under eye level downwards. Above is fine and clean. And then again, the same with the unit. Marks present and discolour. Lampshade not tested. First side cabinet. Marks present. Pink mark present. And then beside the wall and the cabinet, you can see it's quite patchy in paint. This is like a neutral colour and you've got marks on the wall here. You can see it's been dripped. And you've got further marks here. All the way up in the corner. So marks are present just underneath the curtain mount also. Just move the curtain. The curtains are long French door length. Not tested. Windowsill is clean on white. You can see I've seen the grooves as well. It's all clean. And behind. Okay. So the walls are clean with no concerns. Above, clean. In the windows and the door frames are clean with no issues. And then just working my way around, clean condition. However, just above the desk, you do have various further marks. Even in the corner and in front of the desk, above, marks on the wall are present. So just under eye level downwards, everything above is clean. You've got a photo, unit, you've got a couple of marks in line with the unit on the wall. Unit is clean, dust free. And it's all empty, lovely. And then left, you've got a few marks underneath the socket on the wall and then a few more scuff marks towards the bottom. But apart from that, in good condition. Flooring is blue, gray carpet, it's all been hoovered with no visible stains, no hairs, no dust, no dirt. And then the wall between the bathroom and bedroom door, pink marks visible, scuff mark present, marks towards the bottom, handprints visible, scuff mark, handprints on both switches. marks present but above okay however you do have further marks which is quite unusual door to the ensuite clean condition with no concerns above handprint on the extractor fan and then the wall clean however cobwebs present with black scuff mark also present and head into the ensuite the door is clean with no concerns you do have a black mark in the door frame ceiling ceiling is clean white with no cobwebs no stains and light bulbs working and present lovely flooring matching the main bathroom clean with no hairs no dust shining i'm walking on it there's nothing touching my feet there's no bits the Painted walls, good condition with no concerns, no sign of paint peeling above and then left. No signs of paint peeling, no mould, good condition. Mirror is clean and securely attached. Above it's clean and then to the left it's all clean. Unit is all empty. And clean, ready to use. And then we have the tiles, which are white with a black border. Clean condition, white sealant, white grout, 
and the sink. You can see there's no hairs or dust on or around the hand basin. It's clean sealant, no lime scale, both taps working left and right. It does drip a little bit. Good condition of the walls. The tiles are clean, dust free, there's no damage, no cracks, no hairs, white sealant, white grout. Toilet. Flush is fine with no hairs or dirt. There's no hairs or dirt. Shower tray is clean. Shower glass is all clean with no lime scale. Oh, struggled to close. But in really good condition. There's no watermarks. There's no dirt. Clean. Shower tray is clean. Oh, just give a bit of a push. Shower tray is clean with no dirt and no mould or speckles on the sealant, no blockage. The tiles are clean, white with a white grout. Shower head, slime scale present, but the tiles are clean. Lovely, brilliant. Just, um, no, I want to leave the door open. Just going to turn the hallway light off. And then we have the second bedroom. Door open and close is fine with no concerns, no dirt. You do have a sticker in the middle. And then the ceiling is white, clean, with no stains, no leak marks, no cobwebs. Light bulb working and present. And then you've got a white wall here, which I'll do first. It's clean. However, just around the light switch, you do have some discolour. And then scuff mark present towards the bottom. Skirt and boards are clean. Two door wardrobe, not tested. And then the wall shades into magnolia. Clean condition, no black scuff marks and no kind of handprints. Along the bed, you've got a couple of scuff marks present. But overall in good condition. Can't get too close because obviously the bed's in the way. Let's see if I can zoom in. Above the heater. No marks. And then left of the window, it's clean. No marks underneath. However, it's starting to discolour. You've got patches present. Because I think it's dripped at the bottom there. Window sills clean. Window frame and window are clean from the inside. Oh, just locked that. You just need the window key. And then the blind. Blind with no odour and no damage. Rolled up and down perfectly well above the unit. Ah, oh, the window key's here. I think. Yeah, there you go. So the windowsill's clean and the grooves all clean and the window's clean from the outside as well. Perfect. Chest of drawers empty, ready to use. Lamp not tested. The wall is clean with no handprints. Wall is also clean with no handprints, no black scuff marks. No marks on or around the light switch. Just going up and down. Just gonna have to set back a bit. You can see, however, just underneath there's patchy paint present. Skirting boards are clean and white, dust free, walls are over in good condition. Flooring is grey, hoovered, with no hairs, no stains, no odour. And then mattress protector present with white bed. See it's chipped here. It's chipped here and it's chipped there. And you can see in between here, there's no dust or dirt. Okay, that's that. Just gonna leave this door open. So storage, I've done storage, living room. Behind the door, it's clean with no concerns, ceiling, 
is clean with no stains, no leak marks, no cobwebs. However, light bulb's working in present. Left of the light bulb, you've got a mark on the ceiling here. But apart from that, it's all clean with no stains and no cobwebs. Both light bulbs working in present. Just trying to get a different angle. Okay, so let's start with the wall. Right. Let's start with, yeah, this wall. So the wall behind the door, you can see paint has cracked and missing cracked paint here. And then you can see the walls very patchy. You can see it's been painted over in a, dis a different colour. Patchy wall. There's no damage, it's just patchy. Just trying to pick it up, look. Okay. And then on the side again, patchy walls. Above, clean, right, clean. Around the bin, also clean. And then you have two picture hooks, one, two, visible, but there's no handprints, there's no pencil mark, there's no dirt, there's no damage. Behind the chair, it's clean. And then above, you can see it's a different tone of paint towards the ceiling. Clean condition. You do have left, like paint drip, so it's patchy paint here where it's been topped up. Table is clean, used, but with no concerns. These are my keys. And around you can see it's clean with no concerns above clean and then the unit used not tested and then above the bedside cabinet clean with no concerns all empty and clean the walls in good condition with no issues I'm going to tilt the camera and zoom in so you have a good view of the room there's no handprints and then there's no cause for any kind of concern white coffee table and a black lower coffee table used marks present but there's no damage and the sofa tired looking no odor not tested Okay, curtains are window length and the glass and the frames are all clean with no handprints, no dirt, no dust, no damage. And you also get to see the window sills are clean with no concerns. There's just a hole here because the cap's missing. Um, but there's no cause for any concern, no dust, no dirt. See, this was open too. Oh, it's naughty. So you can see the doors clean from the inside and out. Balcony is empty. With no items, no cobwebs above. Glass is all clean. Frames are all clean. And then just going around, window curtains are here. Mm. Then above. Clean condition of the walls, no issues, no handprints, no concerns. White table. With no marks on or around. However, left of the socket but right of the switch, prints present. And then it's slightly patchy again. Ah, so if you look here, you can see the wall's quite patchy. Can you see? One, two, three, four, five, six, and towards the bottom, here, here, and then in the corner, there's some concerns here. But no 
marks on or around the light switch. The flooring is laminate, it's all been hoovered, all been mopped with no hairs, no dirt, no dust. And the table's very sturdy and very stable. So even underneath, you'll see there's no hairs or who, no hoover required. Okay, lovely. No concerns. Lovely. Right, let's head into the kitchen. What's um, here? So one, two, three, four spotlights working on the unit and then the two ceiling lights also working. Items present, ceiling however is clean. Fridge freezer integrated and you can see it's currently off but clean with no odour. No dirt on the door, inside clean condition. Freezer, all drawers present with no cracks, clean condition. The door is clean with no dents, no dirt. Units above, clean condition. Left of the extractor. And then let's turn the extractor on. Fan, fan is working, a light bulb also working. Slightly greasy to touch, but okay condition. Above, no dirt, no grease. Splashback is clean with no concerns and the hob is also clean with no concerns. Right of the extractor, units are currently closed and all clean with no concerns, no issues. And then underneath your integrated Whirlpool dishwasher. To the side, there's no items. Empty and clean. Sink. Items are present, but it's all clean with no water damage. Whirlpool washer dryer. Empty and clean with no concerns. Tray and the drum mold present. I'm actually going to leave it open. Yeah. And then you have your integrated hot oven, pristine condition. There you go, it's sparkling. No dirt, no grease, no marks. Excellent condition. Units. Draw one, draw one, I'm touching it and it's clean, there's no grease like marks and no dirt. Empty, empty. You can see they're all empty and they're all clean. So there's no shimmer from any grease, there's no dirt. Lovely. Top, it's clean with no damage, no burn marks, sink. It's clean. Oh, just out here though. Look, it's leaking from the top. That needs some attention. White sealant, microwave not tested. Because it's all been wiped down and clean. And then the paint is clean with no grease like marks, no stains. Patchy left of the extractor and um, splash back above the mark wave. And the tiles are a light pink with a white grout, white sealant. And above, above the unit, it's clean. Above the unit, it's clean. And then around the switches, all clean. So no splash marks, no water marks. Excellent condition. Around the light switch, it's clean. And the flooring is tiled, clean, with no hairs, no dirt, no dust. Lovely. I'm just going to test the fire alarms. Where are the fire alarms? Aha, yeah. Um...
just trying to test the smoke, the smoke alarm. The smoke alarm is working.